have a little plan for the winter I'm going to uh, plant a lot of winter seeds I did some last year and uh, it was something to do the winter can be a bit boring we'll just go and say hello to Penny make sure she's got the fire on right let's just go and see what's in the mail a gold bar that's very nice we'll just put these away right uh, I'm sure you'll know about winter seeds but actually if you're just starting off in the game um, it's a good way, it, it's helpful to, to get a bit of money in because they're free. All you need to collect is go around foraging in the winter and collect winter root, snow yam, crystal fruit and a crocus. And you just need one of each um, and it makes 10 seeds. You don't need to see a maker, it's in the crafting section. And if you think that through, they don't take long to grow, I think something about four days. Uh, your 10 seeds will grow and from that te 10 seeds you can make more and last year I made enough um, to make myself all these seeds and still have these left over so just for the fun of it that's what I'm going to do this year I'm going to plant them all and uh, make more seeds so on and so forth uh, and just see at the end of the year how much money I've made so I'll leave you there for now while I get on with the hoeing right that's 12 o'clock at night I've got an awful lot in nearly a thousand uh, seeds in there I've only got this little patch to do so we'll do that in the morning okay that's all the winter seed in Oh, I think I've actually missed a row there. Hang on. I think I have. That's better. Right. Now, while you weren't looking, last autumn I made a few changes on the farm. I demolished all this hardwood fence that was around these two big fields and as you can see I've replaced them with uh, preserved bins or whatever you call them uh, in which I'm putting cranberries I would have loved to have been able to put ancient fruit but I just don't generate enough ancient fruit to sustain them however cranberries are pretty profitable see I've missed one there and it's just an extra easy income as you can see I got an awful lot of cranberries last year so I'm not short of them there'll be plenty to uh, to see me through right now the next thing I'm going to do this winter is fishing I'm g in my spare time because there shouldn't be a lot of maintenance on the farm I'm going to spend my days doing as much fishing as I can now normally I sell my fish every day but this year this winter I'm not going to sell them every day I'm going to put them in a storage box and just sell them at the end of the month just to see out of interest how much we could make for fishing over winter so I'm going off fishing I'll get back to you later well here we are it's day eight in uh, winter and things are starting to grow on the farm in bits and pieces it's the uh, ice festival today so I think we'll pop down and see if we can win the ice fishing competition we'll just get straight on with it
Oops. Now what's going wrong here? Come on. That was a bad start. I think you need at least six or seven. <laughs> this is not going well. But the fortune teller did say I was going to have rotten luck today. I'm going to be struggling here, I think. Fourteen seconds, come on. I'm not going to get many more than six. Right. Now, I have won it every year. I'm not so confident <laughs> this time. Is... Yes! Oh, I've got seven! What, I only got six? Here's your prize, 200, no, sorry, 2,000 gold, that'll do very nicely, thank you very much. Uh, day 9, and as you can see, the uh, crops I planted at the beginning are ready for harvesting. So, uh, I'm going to get those in and plant uh, some more. Uh, but I've been doing fishing um, since you were here last and I got something rather good a treasure chest uh, out of a treasure chest in the ocean I've never had one of those before uh, and this is my 13th year I looked it up on the wiki and it's a valuable thing it's worth 5,000 gold had it have been a gold star one, it would have been worth 7,500 gold. So I'm really pleased with that. Right, I'll go back and get on with planting and harvesting. Right, this is the first lot of harvesting of the winter seed. So we've got 281 snow yams, 271 crystal fruit, 291 crocus and 300 winter root. I've no idea what sort of money they're going to bring. We'll find that out um, when we sell them all at the end of the season. Okay. It's day, it's the 16th today of winter and it looks like that first batch or second batch of crops is ready. So I'm going to risk putting in a third crop. Um, I'd better make myself some more seeds. I'm trying to think, should I go for another thousand? Right. 
it. Oops. Here we go again. We'll just get on with uh, taking these out and planting them. Pretty boring for you to watch, so I'll get it all done and uh, see you later. There, that's all this crop gathered in. Um, that'll be the last one for this winter. Um, it's taking about eight days to do uh, a crop. I'm just going to get these cranberries in. It was the wizard's birthday today, but because I've got everyone to ten hearts, I don't have to bother about birthdays, which is mm -hmm. uh, which is great, really. <laughs> So if all I, well, I was thinking about it, all I need to keep back on winter seed is a hundred of each to uh, to make another thousand seeds for next year, and it'd be very interesting to see what kind of money we actually make from them. But I'm still convinced they're a very good thing for people just starting off um, a source of free crops. Uh, you get them from foraging and uh, four of each makes ten seeds uh, what's what's not to like I'm really hoping that these are ah, link <laughs> are worth a lot of money because they are so difficult to catch I hate them. Oh, here's an easy one. I must go to the wiki and check out the price of uh, these lingcod. I hope they're worth the effort. By the way, if you're going to use uh, fishing buff, you know, the food, I do recommend lobster bisque. It, oh, here we go again. Come on. Ah! Hard work, aren't they? <laughs> no, I'd recommend the lobster beast. It lasts, uh, it gives you three uh, fishing, and it lasts nearly all day just for one lobster beast, whereas the other fishing buff doesn't uh, last as long. Okay, back to the fishing. See you later. While I was asleep last night, um, Penny's gone and changed the kitchen floor. And I'm actually delighted. I don't. <laughs> I'm not delighted that uh, your spouses can just go and change your decorations as they please. But I'm delighted with that because I used to have it and I lost it. And I kept going to Pierce to try and get it back again, and I couldn't find it. So well done, Penny. Right, today is the last day of winter, so I'm going round and collecting all the stuff I'm going to sell my aim is to make at least two million gold this winter so that I can make 60 million gold altogether for the end of this year <coughs> I don't know if I'll do it or not I've been fishing like mad uh, we'll just have to see I uh, will take that I'm not going to bother with those. 
can take that and that some of those feathers certainly some of those void eggs I've got an awful lot of eggs there take a heap of those Keep some back for another time. Come on, guys, let me out. Let me out. Now, over here to the good stuff, we've got uh, ancient fruit wine, fruit jelly, cranberry jelly. more wine. Okay. Three storage things full of fish. Um, <laughs> there's a lot of stuff in here. I'm not going to make you watch me collect it all. The rings I don't think I can sell because I think I've got to take them to the Adventurers Guild. Um, all these other items, of course, is what I've got out of treasure chests. Uh, these are what I've got out of geodes that I've had processed. And I also got quite a lot of ore and coal, so I turned the ore into bars. So I'm going to get on with emptying these bins, and we'll get back to you after. Right, we'll have a look in here, what's to go. Um, there's all our winter stuff be interesting to see what that brings um, I'm going to sell some diamonds I've made a lot of diamonds this winter about four or five hundred diamonds so I'm going to save a few I'll save a hundred don't think there's anything else in there I'm wanting to sell I could sell some iridium bars Nothing much in there or there or there. I'll sell some maple syrup, made a lot of that. And I use oak resin to make the fertilizer, pine tar. No, I'll, I'll just hang on to it. That's the last one, I think. i can put these away. And I think that's it. Till tomorrow morning. I suppose I've got time actually just to nip to the Adventurers Guild and sell those rings. So that's what I'll do. That's the... Uh, bins full up for stuff to sell now's the moment of truth have I made over two million dollars to put me to 60 million for the end of year 13 let's see now something rather weird happened there uh, the screen went totally black and the game had to start again and it's uh, come huge pixels and I'm not able to change it so we'll just have to manage with this for now as you can see we cracked it five million four hundred and thirty eight and let's see what the fishing brought us ninety three thousand mm. let's hope those link cod were worth it uh, fishing's fishing awful lot of fish there okay the farming of course always the best Ancient fruit jelly again, over a million. Star fruit wine did well too. Foraging. So the crystal fruit. 
166,000 for that. Crocus 77,000. The Snowy Am 111,000. The Winter Route 85,000. Worth doing. A uh, quarter of a million? So, yes. Yes, well worth doing. Um, mining, that's, this is the stuff, all the stuff that I got out of the treasure chest whilst fishing, so that all goes towards the, uh, the fishing total. So you could say the fishing, um, actually brought me that and that. Bits and pieces, however, we've got our total. So, uh, sorry to leave you on these awfully bad graphics. Uh, thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, uh, please be kind enough to press like and it would be lovely if you would subscribe. Uh, we'll see you soon. Bye!